The incomparable Roberto Duran of Panama, the brilliant former lightweight champion, most feel the best ever, but now with an eye on the welterweight crown, takes his top-rated WBC ranking and that incredible record into the ring today against young Joseph Shibuga of Uganda, who now lives in Oslo, Norway. Look at that record. He is the 10th ranked in the WBC version. He has won 10 in a row. So round, welcome. And La Biblia del Pugilato. Tough assignment for a kid with 12 fights. He does have that amateur experience, his usual type of red shoes. But the point is, Mr. Bull is fighting him the right way. Here in Las Vegas, Dick Stockton, Gil Clancy, and Angelo Dundee. You know, you're right, Angelo. You missed those punches by inches. That's a sign of a real pro. Well, and this is Mr. This is Duran's first 1980 appearance. He was 3-0 and in 79. All of his victories coming in by decision. Duran trying to close it. You know, it overdoes what he tries to do. Now, Duran is a more exacting type of fighter if you stay there with him. I like the way Shibuka keeps those elbows in and those hands. I know that he's, he was involved with some of the best fighters around. On the deck. And he pushed him down. Does not count as a knockout, and the referee, Richard Green, informs Duran of that. The judges are Harold Miller, Harold Buck, and Joe Swessel here in Las Vegas. The right back. Gil, I know why they call, why they call him Stoneface now. Good right by Duran. Nearly <laughs> one minute remaining in round two. Shibuga coming right back at Duran. From England, they told me this kid is a very good fighter. Oh, he's showing me something right now. Really, in the eighth round in his last fight, October 15th. 30 seconds remaining in round two. Have you ever seen Duran in distress, Angelo? No, no, he's a very calm, calculating sort of a guy, but he's getting a little flustered right now. Final set has more than held his own so far against Roberto Duran. I think he's doing a great job. It's the first time ever. Shibuga comes right back. Didn't seem to hurt him at all. Hurt him. Good combination. Something Duran was not able to do against Gonzalez in his last outing. Oh, believe me, this is not the Duran that fought Gonzalez. Shibuga didn't just come to take the fifth, he came to win. Shibuga got hit with the bones about it. He got staggered with that shot. But he took it and he's coming back with fire. 50 knockouts, according to Ring Magazine. Shibuga, 11 and 1 with six knockouts in his 12 fights. Minute and a half remaining in round three, and the body punches usually take their toll later. Duran is starting to get the distance now. He's starting to really bang those punches in there, especially for the body. The thing that Shibuga's doing wrong, he's not jabbing with authority, Gil. In other words, he well, as you pointed out before, Duran is a good defensive fighter. You, you miss him with that stiff jab, and then he counters. He's really nailing Shibuga now. Shibuga is right there. There's a goal in the round, and Shibuga being peppered by Duran's blows here. Yeah, it's all over, Gil. Next shot will get him out of there. A solid left. And Duran has kept the very goal. Trying to finish him off here. He's hitting him some solid punches. What guts this kid has. Let the Shibuga fight back. 30 seconds to go in round. Survives the round how Duran will go because he really let it all out hang out this round. That's right. He expended a lot of energy. In round three, Duran trying to finish him off. Hasn't done it yet. He did come out of the corner. He's looking at his manager. Solid ride by Duran. Hey, Shibuga came out of his corner very, very okay, slowly. Okay, let's have it, let's have it.
this fight. This is a great fight to get him ready for Sugar Ray Leonard. Oh, are you watching? You didn't have to say that. <laughs> what about that? Sugar Ray Leonard battle. Sugar Ray will fight every welterweight out there. There's no problem with Sugar Ray. I'll do. Let's fight now. We... Boy, he comes back. Quite resilient. Big right hand by Duran. <laughs> Duran has made his living wearing down foes. He has 18 first round knockouts, but not so much since he's been a welterweight. Shibuka's legs are not too good now. He's wobbled pretty good across the ring. Minute and a half remaining in round four. And Shibuka. Shibuka ranked 10th according to the WBC. An ounce of fan -off. Fighting out of Oslo, Norway, they call him the Black Norwegian, born in Uganda. Okay, he throws very good punches in close. This kid's getting the shots in also. Yes, he is. I guess it looks like he has weathered just about everything Duran has. Except the minute remaining in round four of our scheduled 10-round welterweight fight on the CBS Sports Spectacular. Just the second of 20 live fights this year, you'll see. There we go. Right hand, right on the button. Another angle. There you go. Duran slips that jab. Right hand over. This is the punch, Gil. Off a of left hook. Bang. Watch. Comes right over the left hand. Left hook. Right hand. But this was unquestionably uh, far more impressive Roberto Duran than in his previous fights, Angel. You agree? Oh, gosh, yes. Are you 